So now we have to do it again because fucking James was. You didn't tell me we were about to start! You said, are you ready? I didn't respond! Well, it doesn't matter. We have what we need. A terrible opener? Yeah, like, I'm just gonna. I'll, maybe I'll just rip it from the thing. Or I'll figure it out. Oh, God. Like, we're just, I'm just gonna jank the levels up really high for a second. <laughs> well, you know what? <laughs> well, you know what? Welcome, uh, folks, to Memory Not Found. We're obviously gonna be playing Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Miss Adventures. <laughs> I remember this sh uh, show when I was a kid. I loved it. It was a good show. Oh, yeah, I know. It was great. Can you believe there were some uh, dill holes out there that didn't like it? No, I can't. Not like parents, but like actual kids. Well, that's because those kids are shitty. Yeah, my brother was an asshole. Shout out to you, Sean, freezing your nuts off in Alaska. Huh. It's not creating save data. It's without saving. Memory card. Creating. And... Seems like it's creating. Oh, oh okay. there we go. Uh, should we play as Ed and Eddie? I don't think it really uh, Go double D. That fucking nerd. <laughs> Dude. Double D was cool. I wonder what was under his hat. I always like to think of growth. Yeah, that's what I always thought. Was like he had like an extended brain. I like to think he had a ta swastika tattoo on his dome. <laughs> Holy shit. That would explain their reaction of like, what the fuck, dude? <laughs> Sorry, my mom's my mom and dad are white supremacists. That actually was playing like two wise like so into fucking me. Oh. Genetics? Uh, look at the animators that actually do this was like, hey, don't animate this, just do stop motion. Oh, yeah. Cool, they you're had, in. They had really weird fucking episode cards. Yeah. I, oh, I dude, never, I love those episode cards. They were kind of scary. Look, guys, it's been fun. Fuck you, Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Purgatory Simulator 2008. <laughs> what the f Okay. This is a good game. This is a good game. Maybe we shouldn't have done this for a fatal error. Fuck that, this is awesome. <laughs> oh, you think we should just put this in the regular continuity? We'll see. I vote yes. We'll see what happens here, like whether <laughs> this is actually enjoyable or not. I think I'm going to. Here you go. I got your coat. Look at that. Push me, I will smash a <laughs> <laughs> Oh, fuck. But yeah, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a train wreck. Jesus. <laughs> um. I go, get my these fucking squirrels. <laughs> squirrels. Find a cat to lift and throw at the dog to get him away from the cooler. <laughs> oh wait, they got that fucking dog in here? What's wrong, Moonu? What's wrong? No, no, go to the dog. I gotta see this. What? I gotta see if it's that dog. It is that fucking dog. Which dog? The... Alright, do you remember like when Ed and Eddie first came out? When they did the garbage? Like when they were in the dump or whatever? Or regardless. <laughs> like when it was about to be uh, on Cartoon Network and you only saw the commercial? Like, the one commercial they had was just them running through, like, uh, the house in the suburb right there, being chased by Ed's little sister and a Sarah. fucking dog. Oh, yeah, huh. You never saw that fucking dog in the show. Oh, yeah, huh. Yeah, and that's that fucking dog. How the fuck? I don't know. That's why I'm amazed. <laughs> oh, look, I got the chickens. It's a big fucking chicken, actually. You think you can handle that, Cock Milo? There's the cat. I guess Milo couldn't handle that cock. I guess not. <laughs> Triangle, I think, picks him up. 
Or O. Oh. oh. There you go. Let's try it. Do 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 do. Just quick as fucking can. Look at it. Just, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> One day, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> I just, just hate it whenever my, my owner, John, Whoa. picks me up and... <laughs> this is gonna be like fucking Sheep Raider, I bet. Uh, probably. <laughs> this might be. Oh, God, that's cube. Oops, my brain stopped again. What? His brain stopped again. <laughs> oh. Is it because I keep running into shit? So, my, what was your favorite episode of Ed, Ed, and Eddie? The one where everything went fucking weird. What do you mean? You know what I meant? Like, the one where they took Jimmy's outline off of Jimmy. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The one okay. where Eddie ate the moon. Yeah, because they realized they weren't in a cartoon? Yeah, yeah. that yeah. one was my favorite one. Whoa. I like the, um... Wow, that fucking I mean, upper lip. Yeah, it's weird. See him put in 3D, you're like, oh... You realize how grotesque these people are. <laughs> you pulled the trigger, asshole! <laughs> what the fuck, Double D? <laughs> um. But I like the fact that they got all the voice actors. That's yeah, that's pretty neat. That's something. Um, I like the uh, when when uh, Ed worked for Rolf. Or actually, no, my favorite's when they when they convince Rolf that he's back in the old country, and they're doing like the fishmonger stuff. Oh, yeah, it's great. My favorite one was when that's, I my, was horse. that's my horse. <laughs> <laughs> that's my horse. <laughs> Bam! No, that's my horse. Uh, our, yeah, there you go. It's circle. Oh, so? Yeah. <laughs> Fucking Jimmy. The metrosexual. Stop it. You sure he was really metro? Because he had, like, no fucking, uh... I don't know, James. You're not very anybody. good at figuring out, uh, who people are, who's gay or not, so I don't think we're I don't make you. terrible assumptions about people. Wait, why would that be terrible? Are you saying that being gay is terrible, James? That's what you're insinuating? Whoa! Not the worst thing you could do, like, you know, kill a Jew or something, but... Wait, that's worse than being... Okay. You gotta... Yeah, there you go. <laughs> that's like the best. He just fucking slams his face into the... <laughs> BAM! I'm gonna lift again. Shit. Triangle, but you gotta not... You gotta stun him first. There you go. Got that squirrel. They gonna dump that squirrel in that pool of water? No, he's gonna throw him through the window. Fuck. I love the tumble <laughs> physics. That was fantastic. You just see it just like fucking casually yeah. roll away. Boom. Nah. I wonder why we're throwing squirrels into this person's Just Jimmy ran in there. Yeah, Jimmy and Sarah it'll, in there. It'll freak him out. You already stunned him, man. At this point, you're just, just smashing your face into squirrel... For my favorite episode is actually uh, the day the Ed stood still. Uh, that's the one where uh, Ed goes crazy watching the monster movies. Oh yeah, and becomes the fucking monster. Becomes the monster. Yeah. Oh dude, that that's episode was fucking gnarly. That was pretty neat. It was. Like the only ones that were left were Double D and Naz. Yeah. I think Naz was like just about to get eaten when they found out it was Ed. It was yeah. like, oh fucking gross. And you had that whole subtle horror thing go on. Oh, that was pretty cool. Fucking terrible. I wonder why this show got... I think it got cancelled, didn't it? Uh, yeah, it did. Like, it didn't get, uh... Actually, it only got cancelled. It just didn't get renewed for a new season. Until, like, five years later. Yeah, and then they had, like, the new episodes where they were, like, yeah, in school. Yeah, they were in school. Stuff, which was kind of cool. Yeah. Uh, but... And those were pretty good. I actually liked uh, the new episodes. The yeah, animation right. was a little weird for me. The animation was weird for you? And like it was, it was a little different. It was more polished. I liked the fact that it looked like it was somebody's kind of meh. Yeah. Um. But uh, anyway, no, I, I, I thought the show was good. I liked watching it. I didn't like 
I didn't. I wasn't in love with like the new episodes, but like they were okay. I liked. Them. I, I liked like, like the, the one, old ones were better. I liked the one where they like they did the the subtle nod towards pornographic I magazines. Because apparently, like, yeah, no, hard, dude. Yeah, I remember it was like, yeah. do you read those, Eddie? And you're like, ah, like all the adults were immediately like, dads. That's, that's a porn mag joke. All the other kids are like, wait, does he not know how to read? <laughs> and the fact that they're looking for it. And then I think, uh, who's the, Johnny. Johnny finds the magazine. Yeah. Because it was. Fucking meatball machine. What? <laughs> <laughs> Who? This voice actor does somebody else. I will find out. He does somebody really important. It's fucking weird. What do you mean really important? Like, like, who who does Rolf does another character, and you're like, wait, that's the same guy? And they're like, yeah, that's the same guy. You're like, what? Oh no, he's released the pigs from a son of a shepherd. <laughs> Look at how panicked he looks. Dude, I would be freaking the fuck out if I had a bunch of wild this hogs running in my really, backyard and my old man would beat me for it. I'm kind of I'm kind of impressed with this game. Really? Yeah, yeah like the visually, amount of detail that they put in like visually, like he looks panicked. Like you're like, oh except wow. like movement motions, but those uh the video scenes are pretty Not good. you! Wow, look at the way that pig is running. Just on both its front legs. <gasps> Oh yeah, look at that, like it scoots its little feet out. <laughs> you can throw it from there, as long as it gets in the pen, you're fine. <laughs> I'm gonna get you, you fucking fuzzy squirrel. Did you find it yet, James? Yeah, I just opened up the IMBD page. Oh, okay. <laughs> Come on, we all have a little bit of head in us. What the fuck? <laughs> like, one of the, uh... Like, obviously, because this was, like, a, a, a lesser well-done kid show. Like, there's not too many, like, big-name actors or actors that have, like, their face on IMDb. Right. But, uh, like, whoever did the voice for, uh, Kevin and, uh, two of the Kanger sisters, like, her screenshot face, yeah, is, uh... Uh, one of the My Little Ponies. Oh, is it, uh... That's right. I have... No, I think, I think one of the guys from Rolf... I think the guy who does Rolf does a My Little Pony one. Let's find out. Uh, His name is Peter Tara, Kalamas. Tara Strong? Oh, he was in 50-50? Neat. Let's see here. And yes, he does. He does Big Daddy McColt. That sounds like a pimp. He's the pony thing. I'm Big Daddy McColt. You want to get with these little poles? You gotta shine coming. up to me. You gotta go talk to Rolf. How did I get all of them? Did you get with the ponies? What? <laughs> you gotta talk to Rolf to get with the ponies, no, not no. Big Daddy McColt. <laughs> <laughs> did you imagine, like, all of a sudden, like, right in the middle of a My Little Pony, oh my God. My Little Pony episode, you just get, I'm the son of a shepherd! Get oh, back dude. here, you fuck. Uh, local population. He did something. Or maybe I'm maybe I'm thinking of something. I'm looking. He's got a lot of uh, oh, does he? voice work. Yep. And also some movie stuff too. He was Lego Yoda in the Star Wars games. Or no, movie, than the Lego Star Wars movies. This dude named Phil in Fifty Fifty. Some doctor on Eureka. Oh, I mean, where the pig went? No, I think he got them all. So? He was in the Tooth Fairy. Or maybe you can just go into the machine now. Oh, yeah, there you go. My, my. Intriguing. Oh, God, I forgot that. Oh, yeah, you need one more. I think if you go into, into Rolf's house, he's got the last ice cube. So that means you're missing an ice cube. 
uh, check back the way we came. Milo! <laughs> Jesus Christ, he's just running into the squirrels. Not nah, just a bunch of like voice actor work and what? I thought he did something. Hold the phone. Oh. That can't be right. <laughs> oh yeah, the squirrels will bite you. I'm dying to fucking- how do I get the squirrels off, though? I think it's circle. Oh, well, maybe it's square yeah. triangle, then. Or try jumping. Yeah, there you go. Huh. I know I beat this level, like, so do we miss one? Here's the use the Oh hey, the jawbreaker. Jawbreaker! I saw it first! Yeah, so how much uh, still need the ice there, man. Yeah, I know. I thought it'd be in here. You gotta use that to pick them up. <laughs> Okay, that's just, just him smacking his head on the ground. You just see him like at a metal concert. He's just like, I will be the best of the most yet. With dark. That was, that's one of my favorite favorite quotes. Huh? Huh? That's fucking weird. You wanna you wanna give this a shot, James? Uh, then I'm trying to figure this shit you wanna out. Give this a shot, Dustin. Yeah. There you go. Cause apparent. According to I am. Uh, DB, apparently Goku had two different voice- Goku and Master Roshi had two different voice actors. Yeah, one for the English, one for no, the- No, in the English, he had two different- three different now. <laughs> is Sean Schmel just the current, or what the fuck? Maybe that-, that maybe it's something to do with- No, 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 because, uh, the guy who voiced Rolf, like, the only, like, major thing I see him in- is uh, the Dragon Ball Z series and the Dragon Ball series doing uh, voice work for Goku and Master Roshi. The problem with that is, like, I know Sean Schmel's the uh, the the dude doing Goku. Okay. So according to this, though, like he's only on for like thirty six episodes. And I know there's a bunch more for fucking Dragon Ball, so maybe he's like an understudy for him. An understudy, or just did all his yells because Sean Schmel couldn't keep that up for fucking hours. Yeah, that's true. Uh, yeah, no. He, yeah, no. Can you, can you see that going in for like the uh, going to all the recording studios? Like, all right, we need to yell, hold it for twelve minutes, then we'll cut to commercial, then you can go for another five, and then say oh, something kind of good. You missed it. Yeah. Duh. Duplons. So when you take the S, you can. Something when I was looking up the wolf stuff. Blood. <laughs> now he's gonna comment on our channel. Go ahead. We, fucking, we could use the goddamn. We could uh, use the views. Yeah. 
These fucking guys stole my <laughs> stole my meme. Duplum. <laughs> That would make a cool uh, title card for Ed and Edit. If only you knew the Ed side of the Force, or just the Ed side of the Force. <laughs> no, we, we need to get you to draw a fucking uh, Ed, Ed and Eddie opening title card for us, James. Yeah, good luck with that. That's hard, because I used to try and do that. Whoa, that's weird. What, the first person? But, yeah. but you like the first person, right? Yeah, that's my favorite. How do I switch again? There we go. Hmm. This should work. Now, why do you need? You just completed scam one. Cool your head. Current game completion five percent. Eight percent. Yay! I have a trouble reading that fast. It's God. This bothers me so much. Plus. <laughs> Rich. Ooh, brown snowballs. Oh God. That's horrifying. Beefy. 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 Yeah, because you got to I finally get that meat ice cream. I'm s I'm fully in support of the scam. What? What? You never wanted to try meat ice cream before? No. I never thought I did till someone offered it to me. Oh no! Oh, that's right. No Ed's allowed. Yeah, this is the reference to one of the one of the episodes. Yeah, like one, one of the, of the very episodes. first ones. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, no, because it was the pool party one yeah. where they all get uh, naked in front of Nas. What? Hello. Bye. Crash that shit. Kick you out? Kick you out. Oh, dude, it's even the same title for it. Oh, yeah. Huh. Crazy, I remember this shit. Next, next episode, we play more of this. This might God, not it's pin the tail else. on the edge. I'm not sure if we're actually going to turn this into a... This might not stay a fatal error for a while. Okay, ready? Yep. Go. Yep. Go. Yep. Go. 